Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Um, I'm not going to say much. I'm going to leave the vote of thanks to one of the trustees, but I'm going to um, try and uh, and share with you what, as we were thinking, all of us like yourselves, what practical thing can we possibly do that will go some way to show our love, our thinking, our prayers with those victims and their families. Naturally, this coming together, you coming together, is a very powerful message in itself. Uh, but we have uh, put also a donation uh, link to a donation site that should be displayed on screen. And we would very much encourage all our friends, all the friends of Manchester, anyone that you know, to give generously to this, and it will go towards, obviously, the, the fund. I know that the City Council are also having that, and there are other uh, charities doing the same thing, and we wanted to express this. This is not just for the DMHC, I must say. A lot of mosques and other organizations have asked us, approached us to take the lead on this, in this uh, case, and we have done that. And I hope that you can share it, you can uh, sort of pass it on through social media and so on, and we can play um, our part, our small part, in that. Um, we heard wonderful prayer say, and we heard a lot of words of comfort. And what I would like to uh, share with you now is a, a few words from our faith as Muslims which are not too dissimilar to what we already have. But it is a time where such words as they are exchanged hopefully will go some way. Our motto at the BMHC is a verse that encapsulates the nature of humanity where Allah, God says, O oh people, we have created you from a male and female, and we have made you different tribes and people, so that you may know one another and get to know each other. So the love that we have, love your neighbor, love your brother, love your enemy, love us. If there was one word to be associated with peace, it's love. Together, they definitely make a much better world. I would say uh, a few prayers now. O oh God, guide us to what is right and enable us to follow it. And, now, and allow us to see evil clearly and enable us to avoid it. O oh God, give us the strength to be truthful, to be truthful to you and to our fellow human beings. O oh God, enable us to hold fast to that which is truthful. Enable us to hold fast to your covenant. On this note, I would now like to invite our General Secretary of the Board of Trustees, Brother Afzal, just to say the vote of thanks and after that, we invite you to the food, which is in various uh, places around the stage. There should be four or five stations that will enable us all, inshallah, to take whatever is available and, uh, and, and, and to go then after that for prayers for Maghrib uh, in the main building. Afzal. 